I'm Joe Cuenco with Family Resources. Today we're going to be talking about the easiest choice you may ever have to make. Specifically, how to marry your best friend. Marrying your best friend is really an outstanding thing, so if you have the, the opportunity to do this, then bravo. The real key to a successful relationship is actually having that friendship because friendship is, is really the nucleus of, of making sure that a relationship goes long term. Many successfully, happily married long-term couples have, would consider themselves as best friends, as, as their soulmates, but it's that friendship that really began to draw them together and also was something that lasted throughout the years and kept that long-term relationship successful. These couples actually enjoy one another's company and want to be with each other most of the time, if not all the time. They are very supportive of one another. Now, not that they don't have other friends and other relationships. The fact is that they choose to be with one another. So, so if you have the opportunity to be a partner and marry your best friend, then this is a very wonderful thing to do. Now, at first, the romantic attachment may be something that may grow, or, or in the romantic attachment may be there right up front. If it's something that's grown, and grown then maybe uh, it's a little awkward at first to talk about, well, let's go out on a date. This is how I feel. I want more than a friendship. Uh, I'm looking at you as a partner. And so it's really a communication because if you have that friendship, then you, have, you should have the ability to share at the emotional level. So it, it really becomes an easy question. Just pop the question and just, just do it, like they say with Nike. Don't forget that the, the friendship is there. Treat it like gold and count your blessings. So if you are successful enough to marry your best friend, then congratulations. I'm Joe Cuenco, Relationships for Life.